it. Okay, in this video we're going to show you how to configure the events in the LuxRiot server so you can get email notifications in case of camera loss. So first in the VMS you want to right click the server that you want to set up the events for and go to tasks go to configure server events okay ours popped up in the background we'll just pull it back up okay so you have three panes you have events you have event action and actions so what we're going to be doing is taking events from this side and actions from this side and putting them together so for instance the 180 right camera when video is lost you get an email notification sent to whatever email you set up so in order to do that you would just go video loss punch that over this way and then you go down to uh, where is it? send email or email notification send email and then to the email we're going to set up and then you just connect together like that Okay, in order to set up these actions and events, you go to Tools, Configure Devices, and you go to Add Device. And then type, you go to Email Notification, and then you configure all your email stuff here, uh, your server host, your server port, your username, password, and the sender address. And then you hit OK. We already have one set up, so I'm just going to go to that one. Scroll down. Here it is. So we're going to go to edit. That's not it. There we go. You go to edit. Okay. So our title is email notification. That's what appears right here. Um, and then our server host is edigitaldeals.net. Our server port is the default, which should be, I think, 25. So you just leave it empty and it will be default. Um, the username that we have is info at eDigitalDeals. We put our password in. Uh, we don't have security on it. And then the sender info or the sender email is info at eDigitalDeals.net. After you get that set up, you have to set up the action. So we're going to click Add Action. And then this is the, where you configure where the email gets sent. So in our case, well, in the window, the title is send email. Um, you can change that to whatever you want. We I renamed ours to eDigital Deals. And then the two would be um, whatever email you want to send it to, the subject and the message, and then you would hit OK. For the one we have set up, let's go to edit was eDigital Deals. I set my email up. Um, video loss on Fairplex DVR, video loss on Fairplex DVR. Um, click OK, OK, and then now it should have saved right there. It saved the action in the event. So then you just go through all your cameras here and click click them over to the map, the event action map. So like I was saying earlier, for the 180 camera right, make sure we have video loss selected. You click it over, it's already right there. And then for email notification, you click email notification and then you click send email mail to eDigital Deals because that's the one we set up. And you click that over there. Oh, I took it off, so we're going to put it back on. Make sure it's selected and put it on. Okay, so now for all these cameras, we're going to add the second email, which is the Fairplex email. So we're just going to go over and do that. See how another line was made for the same event. And then you just want to go through and do that for all the cameras you have. And make sure you select the cameras that are on, the, or not on, but plugged in. Because if you select a camera that isn't plugged in, or if you select something that's not a camera, for, for instance, a server, uh, for recording errors or something, you're constantly going to get emails, and that's not that's not good. So for this server, all the cameras he has connected are named. So 
if you scroll down here, we only select the ones that, that have names like 180 right, aisle 6, looking in, a hallway, outside right, hot dog machine. But we didn't select HC7008L board because that's not connected because it's not named. He didn't name it. Um, so just something to remember when you scroll down because some of these might not be cameras. They might be other events like I said the server for disk errors or text inserters stuff like that okay and then all you gotta do is click save and I'll say event map has been changed save yes it's gonna flash a little bit and then you're done click close and you've now just set up email notifications for video loss